Hello and welcome. This is a guide on how to use Swan and his concentrated beam to kill vipers on void thrashing. For mass threes, you want maximum concentrated beam because we'll need it to we need the width. Structure health because that's always better, and of course laser drill build time. Okay, so let's get this. We're gonna start with the um, money and fast build so that we can, so I, I can just show you. Okay, um, sometimes when you fight, these two, after fighting for a while, these two poles will get knocked down. So you can um, knock them out first. You don't have to knock them out, but I don't want to use them as markers because they can get in the way. Okay, so um, if you build your armory immediately, your first concentrated beam should be ready at about 430. So the first one, first concentrated beam, you want to aim it right here. You see this intersection right here? All right, so if you aim it right here, this is what's going to happen. These two vipers are gone. This viper is gone. All of them, they're dead. So the right side of the fourth area, the vipers are all gone in the first shot. Then the second concentrated beam, three minutes later, will be around 7.30. Of course, give or take 10 seconds, but about 7.30. And the next one... Um, this is mainly for those who plan to use wraiths because vipers wreck wraiths. So the next concentrated beam will be aimed right here. You see that there's a little Y and then there's like a dot right here. Look at this dot. And then let's see what happens. This spore this spore, this spore, and all the hydralisks on this side are gone. So mainly, you take out the spores with this one. Of course, you can aim it... Well, with, the reason why this guide is necessary or useful is that even if you don't have vision of the far end, you can shoot down stuff. So you can use the beam on cooldown just by looking at a spot near your base and you'll be able to knock out key units or structures. The next one will be um, used on the third area and you aim right here, this spot right next to this one. Note that my graphics are set on high. So if it's different on other settings, I'm not sure, but here, you aim here and this is what happens. Spore gone, spore gone, viper gone. All of these are gone. And it doesn't kill enough to like trigger the, the next set. So it's pretty much like a free kill. I decided to kill the bottom first because sometimes you can fly around and start getting like attacking the side. Of course, if you are playing in a duel and you're faster than this, then this won't be really necessary. But of course, and you can also change the timing. So like, you don't need to shoot this first. You don't have to shoot this. You can just shoot the third area immediately. Anyways, um, that one should be around, that one at first was around 1030. The next one, the fourth one will be around 1330. And that one, you will aim right here. You see, um, even with just my vision, you can see this area. So you see this dot? You see this dot right here. You aim for this dot. And this is what happens. Concentrated beam ready. Spore gone, spore gone, viper gone. Like that, without even, 
without having vision of the area, snipe the viper. And then the last one that's important will be around 7, 1630, sorry, 1630. And you aim right here. This spot right here, you see um, there's this crack, this line right here, it's in the middle. It's in the middle, and this is what happens. Viper, 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 gone. Spore, gone for good measure. And now, all the Vipers on the map are dead. Of course, if you're fighting explosive threat, that's another thing. But against every other comp, all the Vipers are gone, and your Wraiths are free to kill everything just just fly around and kill everything you have extra ones at like 1930 or so and um you can just use them on attack waves or on whatever you want but with all the vipers gone you'll be able to just your wraiths will be able to ha have fun all right um one bonus thing i'll show you once this loads Okay, so one more thing you can do is with a pulse cannon, you can teleport here and then right here, this spot between these two guys. Okay, so let's go back. Let's take a look at what just happened. Here. Teleport a Herc to the right side. You aim the pulse cannon right here. And two Vipers are dead. So if you missed concentrated beams or you don't want to use it, you don't want to use two beams to kill two Vipers, you can use one pulse cannon and kill both vipers by aiming at this spot all right and that's it for this guide so get rid of those vipers so your wraiths can have fun